If you love beauty and skincare, this doll she shop with me is for you, y'all. This is a new location that I'm shopping at. It's about to street from my house, and they have all of the viral products that I have been looking for. I'm so excited. So first are all of these serums from the brand Skin Nutrient Botanicals. We have been seeing this brand in Dollar Tree for years and years. At first Dollar Tree was just stocking this one here. Their Double Strength Retinol Night Repair Cream. I have used this one and I did not like it. It wasn't doing anything for my skin. So because of that I did stop using it and this was years ago. And most recently I did pick up another serum from them. It's not this one, but it does have vitamin C in it. And the one I picked up is their Hyaluronic Acid plus vitamin C. I think it's Hyaluronic Acid 2% plus vitamin C 1%. I've really been enjoying it, and I'm so glad that they have added new serums. Oh my gosh. So first is their Glycog Acid plus Witch Hazel 2-in-1 Solution. So for this product, this is going to offer a mild exfoliation for skin clarity without excessive irritation to minimize pores and give us visibly softer skin. This sounds lovely. Let's check out the ingredients and see what exactly is in this. So we have some coconut oil, some fruit extracts, a probiotic, witch hazel, and glycolic acid, as well as hyaluronic acid. This sounds great. I'm definitely going to grab this. Next, they have their nice and my 5% plus squalene serum. Ooh, definitely going to try this as well. So this one is to help reduce skin blemishes, congestion, and inflammation, help to brighten skin and soften. And I personally love using products with squalene in them because of the hydration that squalene gives and in the ingredients i'm seeing niacinamide glycerin kojic acid black tea and squalene this just sounds lovely and this one here is told to be their best selling this is their multi peptide anti-aging serum this is reminding me of the brand the ordinary's multi-peptide serum is designed to reduce the appearance of wrinkles and eliminate dark spots and puffiness and nourish with a breathable film on the skin surface to support elasticity i think i'm also going to try this one as well then lastly we have the vitamin c one percent the vitamin c is a nutrient for collagen production and a stable form of vitamin c blends to reduce most common signs of aging dark spots sunspots and uneven skin tone now i'm not going to get this one only because it's one percent according to webmd and some dermatologists on the internet you need at least two percent of the active ingredient for it to be beneficial and since this one's only one percent i'm going to pass on this one but if you have picked this one up and you've been trying it for at least a month consistently let me know down in the comments how it's been working for you and i have finally found global beauty care's new line this line is tell it to be global beauty cares take on the brand bubble and we've seen the bubble skincare brand but we've shopped at walmart i'm seeing three total products so we have their cleansing daily face wash their balancing toner mist and their purifying daily cleansing wipes you guys already know i'm going to grab one of each and i could have swore that it had a fourth product in this line so for this cleansing facial wash let's look at the ingredients i love that on the packaging they're telling us exactly what each ingredient is going to do for our skin so this has cucumber aloe vera and green tea the cucumber is going to hydrate the aloe vera is going to moisturize and the green tea is going to help soothe and revitalize our skin's appearance that sounds great and i love this cute purple packaging and this cleanser is designed for all skin types which is good because i have combination skin or the balancing toner which this is the one i'm most excited for it has witch hazel tea tree and willow bark in it the witch hazel is an astringent to help purify the skin the tea tree is essential oil to help clean acne prone skin and the willow bark is helped to control oil and minimize the appearance of pores. This is perfect for me and my skin type. My pores can tend to be large, but I have been working on them for the last two years, so they definitely have shrunk a lot. But since that's not how they're designed to be, I have to make sure I stay up on my skincare and continue to use products that are going to help keep them small and minimize. And as for these, these purifying cleansing wipes, they have tea tree, witch hazel, and aloe vera in them. I'm really excited that these have tea tree in them. Also from Global Beauty Care, this is multivitamin serum. It looks like these two products go hand in hand. They're both multivitamin and the packaging on them is both that pretty silver packaging. Let's check out the ingredients and see if I'm going to grab both of these. So for this serum, it's vitamins B, C, E, and niacinamide. Now, unfortunately, it does not give me the 
percent of how much niacinamide is in here which is okay so we can just look and see where niacinamide falls in the ingredients all right if you can see niacinamide is a little bit closer to the bottom and comes white after which hazel which isn't horrible i would prefer it to be higher up in the ingredients i'm going to pass on this because i'm already getting this one here the niacinamide five percent with squalane i think this one will give me better results than this one here and for the brand extra care this is their take on vaseline's cocoa butter hand cream i actually have the vaseline version you can find it at dollar tree i'm gonna grab this one i think and compare it to my vaseline one and they're still stocking these fabulous products from spa essentials these are spa essentials exfoliating foot scrub and smoothing foot cream i did pick up both of these and i have tried them both i really like them my favorite of the two is the exfoliating foot scrub with brown sugar and almond oil this one reminds me of my body scrub that i use from dove dove has a body scrub they used to call it a body polish but then they rebranded it and now they call it a body scrub that has brown sugar and cocoa butter i forget i know for sure it's brown sugar and it is lovely on my skin and i've used this i kind of compared them to to each other and they were kind of similar another product from global beauty care that i've been looking for are these brightening toner pads y'all i am so excited that i found these i don't even know what's in them so this one is formulated with glycolic acid lemon and honey so i can see why they're calling themselves a brightening toner pad now i do have past experience with trying to brighten my skin using a lemon cucumbers a couple other fruits and it did not work so i don't have that high of expectations for this but considering it does have the glycolic acid and the honey in them i have a little bit of hope let me know if you've used this product and what you think and this location has a good amount of stock two products that i love first is lucky super soft witch hazel solution y'all i love this stuff i travel with it and the dermosol labs glycolic acid and tony solution with glycolic acid with hazel and rose water i love this as well this is what i put replaced my the ordinary glycolic tony solution with most recently the ordinary raised the price on the glycolic acid it's like 1650 compared to this being a dollar 25 and in my opinion y'all this works better than the ordinary brand i have noticed that my skin is a lot brighter and more even toned and i think that is because of the rose water another new product from global beauty care this is the cellulite body cream with caffeine and mint you guys already know how i feel about caffeine in my skincare it has just never done me right and sometimes global beauty care products haven't done me right either so let's look at these ingredients so we have caffeine which is going to stimulate the circulation for a more radiant firmer looking skin peppermint oil has toning and cooling effects for fresh and vigorous filling skin and collagen will help renew tighten and plump and moisturize for smoother firmer looking skin all that sounds very promising i might give this a try i might test it out on my thigh or something just to see how it works and from the brand kissable we have their deep pore charcoal acne scrub this is a acidic acne treatment we already know when it comes to products that have active ingredients we need at least two percent so for this product as you guys can see it only has one percent of the acidic acid so because of that this is probably not going to give us any results another new product from global beauty care this is their glowing exfoliating toner with niacinamide peptides and vitamin c and because of the packaging i believe these go together so this is the glowing line that global beauty care gave us earlier they have three different lines they have the glowing the blemish control and then this one here the smooth and lift i have every product in the smooth and lift and every product in the glowing did not know that they made a toner so this toner has niacinamide peptides and vitamin c which is similar to the other products in the glowing line with the skin cream it's formed with niacinamide ahas and vitamin e I'm so excited to try this because I like all the products that are in this glowing line. So I think I'm definitely going to like this. In addition to being formula and niacinamide, it also has peptides and vitamin C. So the peptides are going to support collagen, which is help our skin look smoother, and the vitamin C, which is going to help clarify, exfoliate, and brighten our skin. And we have a variety of masks, so many, some I've actually never seen before. I've never seen this before. One of my favorite brands, Be Pure. This is the Refreshing and Relaxing Duo Mask. The Refreshing is their Honey Cleanser, and the Relaxing is their Lavender Mask. The Honey Cleanser is going to help nourish and soften skin, and the Relaxing Lavender Mask help relax the skin and reduce the appearance of pores. I have found more of those warming eye masks, y'all. Do y'all remember when we saw these? It's been a minute since we've seen them. I thought they were so cool because they are self-heating eye masks. 
And this one is a lavender scented. And Dollar Tree has been bringing back out Global Beauty Care's fresh and fruity line that has four different products in it. The strawberry plus hyaluronic acid glowing facial moisturizer with vitamins A, C, and E to hydrate and boost radiance. Their papaya plus citric acid for surfacing enzyme mask to exfoliate and brighten skin. Their kiwi plus collagen acid renewing facial cleanser to brighten even skin tone. And their pineapple plus glycolic acid exfoliating facial polish to smooth and minimize fine lines. Since this line has been out for several months, so let me know down in the comments if you've tried any other products in this line. I've heard great things about this product here with the papaya and the citric acid. And recently I found some cleansing wipes that are formulated with the pineapple and glycolic acid. I can't remember where I got it. I don't remember if I got it at Dollar Tree or if I got it at Burlington. From Global Beauty Care, we have their exfoliating foot treatment mask, which y'all, I don't think I've seen this before. Most of the foot masks I've seen have been from Be Pure. So for this foot mask, it's gonna peel away calluses and dead skin cells, soften crack heels and rough dry feet. These masks we have to wear for 60 to 90 minutes. And then our, we will notice our feet begin to peel four to seven days after use. That's actually not too bad. I'm gonna pick this up and try this. And I haven't seen this before. This is a neck decollete sheet mask from a Be Pure formulated with hyaluronic acid and fruit extracts to help hydrate and soothe neck and chest. I might grab this. This just looks really cool and fascinating to me. And it's only $1.25. And Dollar Tree still has a lot of masks from the Ben Benji farm. We have the carrot mask, the Camilla mask, the broccoli mask, the shea butter mask, olive mask, and the condola mask, and the blueberry mask. That is seven different formulations to pick from. There's so many, and I can't recall if I have picked up one of these or not. Just in case I haven't, I'm going to grab the carrot. And now I think about y'all, they also have a beet one. So I think that's the one that I have. I have the beet one, and I got it because I read somewhere that beet is good for hydrating and even toning skin. This location has a good amount of stock of beet peers, newest hot, cold eye patches. These are the summer prints, a sunflower and cherries. My favorite prints were the prints that came out before these. The lemons, those were my favorite. So you guys know I had to grab me some of those. And I'm undecided if I'm gonna get either one of these. Let me know in the comments if you picked up one of these. This is something I haven't seen before from the brand Next Gen. This is their coconut oil and hemp seed oil body lotion enriched with essential oils and natural botanicals. So far y'all, I have yet to find a decent lotion here at Dollar Tree. All the lotions that I've run into at Dollar Tree have sucked. They either don't have glycerin in them or they have mineral oil in them, which you guys know I don't really care for mineral oil because essentially mineral oil is baby oil. And in my experience, baby oil does not get absorbed well into the skin. And unfortunately for this lotion here, as if you guys can see, it has mineral oil as like the fifth ingredient. So because of that, I'm definitely gonna pass on this one. And my Boo Dermaso Labs has a lotion as well. The Aloe Fresh Moisturizing Lotion. And y'all, unfortunately, this one also has mineral oil in it. Like I was saying, I have yet to find a body lotion, not a hand lotion, a body lotion that does not have mineral oil in it. I don't understand why they're putting mineral oil in everything. Dermacil has a lot of body and hand lotions like this one here. This is their dry skin treatment, hand cuticle cream, their cocoa butter, and their eczema relief body lotion. Unfortunately, they all are formulated with mineral oil and I don't know why. It's so frustrating. And this is one of Dollar Tree's newest body lotions by the brand Pro Silk Body. This is their daily moisturizing lotion since it was aloe vera and vitamin E. And this one's also formulated with mineral oil from the brand Personal Care. This is their Intimate Shave Cream. It's water-based shave cream and moisturizer in the scent Vanilla Cake. If you've been keeping up with my videos and watching my hauls and shop with me and things, you know that I have been on the search for a Dollar Tree shave cream. And so far, y'all, I have not found a good one. These are the two that I have tried so far, and I don't like either one of them. This one, I feel like, washes right off the skin, and this one, I feel like, doesn't create a good enough skin barrier between my skin and the razor, like, that it just drags across my skin, so I'm back to the drawing board. I recently picked up this one here from Extra Care. This is their hydrating shave cream. I haven't tried it yet, so wish me luck. 
Here's another product that I've been seeing all over TikTok from the brand Power Stick. This is their Active Sport Anti Chafe Body Glide Cream with Aloe Vera. So this product is designed to be on your thighs, your underarms, your mid body, your upper body, and in the areas that you may chafe. I do get a little bit of friction, not necessarily like chafe chafing, but I do have a little friction so like when the eyes rub together. So I might give this a try. Let me know down in the comments if you try this product. Because so far, some of the products I've tried from Power Stick have not lasted that long. That same brand, Power Stick, I have found their body spray in the Soft Floral and the Brazilian Mist. And in that same Soft Floral, we have their deodorant wipes. I recently picked up these wipes. I haven't tried them yet. I need to hurry up and try them to see if I like them so I can stock up on them before they stop stocking them. So these deodorant wipes are infused with hydrogen, aloe vera, chamomile, and vitamin E. And since I picked up these wipes, I have been looking for this body spray. And I like the way that it smells, but I do like the Brazilian Mist over this one this one has notes of fresh flowers but not like roses and things like that think more like fruity flowers i'm going to pass on this body spray because y'all this body spray does not last long at all it lasts maybe 15 minutes literally as soon as you spray it it's gone it lasts longer in a room than it does on your body so i keep mine in my car to help freshen it up and i also use it as a room spray i don't know why it doesn't last that long on the body and as for body washes, we have a few new ones from Power Stick to go with that body spray. We also have a shower gel that smells just like the body spray. I did pick this up. I'm going to try it and I'll let you guys know how I like it. And from personal care, we have their new scents for this season. We have the pumpkin spice, the sea salt and cedar, and the sugar cookie. I picked up all of them except for the pumpkin spice. I didn't really like the smell of it. I definitely smelled the, the spice as far as whatever they use to give the hint of pumpkin. I'm not really a fan of it. As for hair care, I'm seeing these two new products here. I've been seeing these on other people's channels. These are from the brand Earth Clean Beauty. I have not heard of them before. So first we have their Smooth and Shine Shampoo with vegan keratin and hibiscus and the, the matching conditioner. And they also have a weightless volume conditioner with bamboo and biotin. We have previously talked about hair care products with keratin in it and i was sharing with you guys that although i don't have any personal experience with keratin it's mainly because i've heard that keratin can be damaging to your hair it dries it out which in turn will cause your hair to break off so that's the main reason why i've never tried anything with keratin in it and as for this one this one has the bamboo and the biotin now back in the days y'all taking biotin was got real popular and i tried it didn't do nothing for me but i've never tried using a hair care product with biotin in it so i might give this a try let me know that in the comments if you've ever heard of this brand Earth Queen Beauty before. And here is a new shampoo from the brand Spa Soap. This is their green ultra hydrating shampoo to nourish, restore, and shine. Phosphate is enzyme free. And they also have the matching conditioner. And Spa Soap is the same brand that is giving us shampoo and conditioners. They're from a different oils like argan and olive oil. And they also have a cocoa butter one. And as for makeup, let's start down here in the bins. So I saw these on someone's TikTok page. A cute little two-pack set of lashes from the brand Wet n Wild for only $1.25. Unfortunately for me, y'all, I do not wear lashes. But if you do, this is a great deal. So not only do you get the lashes you also get the lash glue. And these are in the style Shutter Shock, which is the only style that I'm seeing them in. And if you need a place to store your makeup brushes, they have these really cute brush containers in pink and black that say face, eyes, and lips. These are too stinking cute. They have a variety of mascaras from the brand Beauty Intuition. When we ran into these a couple weeks ago, I was talking to you guys about my bad experience with using mascaras from Beauty Intuition. So far, y'all, today, I have not found any mascara in Dollar Tree that I like. So if you've purchased a mascara from Dollar Tree that you like that gives you volume and length, drop it down in the comments. A variety of lashes from the brand Ioni and more lashes from the brand LA Colors. These lashes are some of LA Colors' newest lashes that Dollar Tree has. If I'm not mistaken, they come in six different color packagings. So they have three different wispy styles. The top pink one is the cat ass style and the bottom darker pink one is their natural style. I've been seeing more stock of this fabulous product from LA Colors. This is their lip oil, y'all. This is fabulous. They have it in 
four or five different scents this one in my hand is the pomegranate they also have dragon fruit grapefruit and lychee i have them all except for this one so i'm definitely gonna grab this one i know i was just ranting and raving about not being able to find a good mascara here at dollar tree but i do have this one technically this is not a black mascara this is a clear mascara so the, it's an exception to the rule y'all this is fabulous so this is a wet and wild clear gel formula to tame and define your lashes and your eyebrows now i've tried it in my lashes and my eyebrows it doesn't really do so much in my eyebrows and that may be because my eyebrows do need to be maintained and waxed because they're a little unruly right now but as for my lashes y'all this literally looks like i have a lash lift they make my lashes look so beautiful so if you haven't tried this yet i definitely recommend that you do and how cute is this eight piece manicure set from the brand gem never heard of them before so we get two nail clippers a cuticle pusher tweezers and emery boards and down here in the bins we have a lot of makeup sponges from be pure so this one is their makeup Wendy sponge infused with green tea oil they also have one that is infused with rose oil and i also feel like they have a a blue and white one that i've seen before and from sassy plus chic we still have these cutely packaged beauty puffs these are so adorable now i know we've seen a product like this before but i don't think it was this one i believe beauty puff that we saw that had a cute little container was much larger than this it was from sassy plus chic but it wasn't this small it's perfect to keep in your purse how cute is this set from sassy plus chic this is their eyeball grooming kit which i think i might grab this so we get a little eyebrow razor and a spoolie and we can get our eyebrow razor in either black or purple. And I have found LA Colors Halloween makeup line. It's a little sparse. So all I'm seeing is a purple eyeliner and a colored mascara, shade navy, and in the shade purple. Let me know down in the comments if you have found, if you've seen this full collection yet and what the other item is. And I found the Stilia lip gloss that has been going viral over all over TikTok. I have yet to see anyone try it. I'm not gonna grab it only because I have tried still your products before and I'm not a fan of them. I feel like they don't last long. There's no color payoff. I feel like they're only going viral because typically this product is $24 at Sephora. I don't believe it is worth it at all. Let me know if you have found this product and you've tried it and what you think.